In today's video, we are hatching the shark egg that we got from the dark web. Let's see what's inside. What's up? I'm here for the party. Sure, bro. Just, it's out back. What are you doing? What do you mean, what am I doing, bro? I'm throwing a banger! Nah, no, dude, we don't have time to throw parties, bro. We got a shark egg to hatch, let's go. All right, all right, I'll, I'll shut it down. Guys, here's a quick recap of how we got this dark web shark egg. Check it out. Oh my God, wow. A lot of Cheeto puffs in there. This is definitely a pedophile's book. <laughs> they like babies. Something. Parents, hide your kids, man. <clears throat> this, look at that, the head just came off. This could be it. I think this is it. This could be it. This is it. This, this is, it. This is, is it. it. Get him with a tongue. You cannot see into that at all. There's nothing in this. What the f hell is that? No, that's an egg, dude. Guaranteed. Oh oh, it's, yeah. it's moving. I see it. I see it. It's moving in there. It's alive. Guys, first things first, shout out to Jacob Williams. You are awesome. He says, you guys are literally by, by far my favorite YouTubers. Every day I go on to see a new video, it makes me happy. And I love the Doom Dog. We love him too. Now let's hop into it. You guys are gonna love this one. It's awesome. Check it out. Yes, today is the day we are heart. We are heart harvesting. Harvesting. <laughs> yes. Today is the day we are hatching our dark web shark egg that we got in one of these boxes. These are all. This isn't even half the boxes that we got so far in our last like two weeks of videos. We've been just cranking these out, dark web, black market, just killing it. We ordered a huge pallet, so if you haven't seen those, click all over here and go watch all those videos. But yeah, the best thing we found was the shark egg. It came in one of these boxes and it's a tiny egg with a baby shark inside of it. We don't know what kind of shark it is or what it looks like at all. All we know is it's time to hatch. The egg is cracking. We think we're gonna get this sucker out today. All right, it's that is very true. Now guys, we've had one in the past that we let it stay in the egg too long and ended up rotting in the egg, so that's why we're gonna be hatching it right now. It's got little cracks in the top right, top right corner, like you said, so that means that the shark is trying to come out of the egg, so we're not gonna let it sit in there any longer. We're gonna get him out, even if he has a little bit of yolk, he's gonna be fine. I hope he lives. Just cross your fingers, everyone at home, cross your fingers and hit the like button. That'll make him live. So the comments on our last couple videos, most of them, or a lot of them, have been Updates on the egg. You guys want to see what's in this egg. The glass is on so you can make sure you see everything clear. Let's see, I'm gonna show you guys what is actually in this egg and what we're gonna do. Let's get that light over here. So there's the shark head right there in the front of the egg and it's starting to crack a little on the side here so we're gonna peel this back. See that crack right there? That's what you want. You want that shark egg to start cracking it, start wanting to get out of this egg. So it's time to get this shark out and hopefully he lives and he's chilling. Look, it's Finn moving right there. It's Finn's moving. <laughs> crikey, this is a big ass alligator. Holy crikey! It's alligator. Holy freaking giant. It could be a freaking Goliath alligator. Have you ever heard of those? Look it up on uh, Google. <laughs> Look it up on Google. You see, type in Goliath alligator. All right, here, crikey. Can you open the egg or what? I need scissors. I think you could feel it. I'm switching accents now. I know. Me Give too. me this. What do you want? Scissors! Jack's gonna do I it. I'm agree. switching places. Make sure you put the glasses on so you can see everyone. All right, thank you. Remember, everyone at home, if you have a pair of glasses, put them on now. And look up Goliath Alligator, because we got one in our tank. All right. I'm Surgeon Jack here. I don't usually wear glasses, but for this, I need to. All right, guys, so the past week, we've been witnessing this thing trying to get out of the egg. Just trying, 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 and that's how there's those little cracks in the top right corner, so that's from him trying to bust his way out. So we called our local fish store to make sure that if he came out with a little bit of yolk left in his sack, that he would be he would be okay. 
And they said it'll be completely fine, so that's why we're going ahead and taking them out because, like I said earlier, the one that we had before completely rotted inside the egg. That was like a year ago, and we don't want this to happen here. So we know for a fact, if he comes out of this egg early, he will survive. Let's cut him out. Y'all, if you look right here, you see this crack right here? Right now, I'm gonna open it up. Look at that. See, see that crack? He's been trying, here's his head right here. He's been trying to get out. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna peel this back. That's a big alligator egg. Oh my God, look at that Goliath alligator. Holy shit, Holy, holy moly. All right, now I got it separated. So I'm gonna peel it back and he might come right out right now. Oh my god, look at his head. Holy crikey, that's a big gator. <laughs> Holy cow, look at that Goliath alligator. Holy crikey. Don't get bit by him. I know, I'm trying not to. Nope. I think I need a scissor. Did, did you just drool on my freaking arm? I don't think I, I did. I think you did. It's all over your shirt, look. Oh. Look at your shirt. <laughs> Where? Right there. Right on there and I, I think you got it on my hair. I think I might have drool on his arm. All right, give me this freaking thing. All right, I need the light, Mike. Okay, peel this back. This is 101 shark egg. And then you come in here. You don't want to cut your don't shirt. Don't cut his head off. No, you cut right here just to get it started. Just like that. And then I give these surgeon scissors to here. There oh he my is. God. Here he comes. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go, y'all. Holy hell. Oh my God. Now there's a little bit of a shield here. Extra protection. So I'm going to go in from over here. Okay, now I'm inside there. You don't want to cut that yolk sac. That's what he's eating off of. So you just go right here along the edge like a surgeon. I went to med school. Yep. There you go. And here he comes, y'all. I think he's gonna come out right now. Swim, buddy. Go. Oh, here he comes. Here he comes. Oh my god, he's so tiny. There he is. Oh. Oh my god. He's out. Oh my god, he's out. It's a shark. Holy hell. We have a shark. Now they say as soon as he comes out, he does not know how to swim whatsoever. So we're just gonna leave him, and we're gonna let him do his thing for a little bit. Yeah. And we had that shark egg for probably. Four weeks probably or so. Longer, probably, probably longer. Probably longer. He probably was already in shipping here from the dark web for a there while. His gills. Oh, yeah, his gills is moving. Look at him. So it was time to hatch him. I'm taking my surgery glasses off. My work is done. Oh my god, look at he's breathing. First time breathing in the water. Wow. Out of boy. Out of boy. Oh, there goes his tail. Yes. Swing that thing around. You're not in an egg no more. Get, that, get the damn light. That's a new kind of alligator. It's like a strap one. <laughs> He'll still keep eating that yolk, and then as soon as the yolk's absorbed, then we'll feed him fish, you know? This is what he was inside of for about six weeks, over over a month and a half. I mean, would you live in this? Comment down below if you would live in this for a year for a million dollars. I don't think I would. Guys, we're gonna run to the store right now. We're gonna get a basket like this, you know, one of the baskets like these, like these. And we're gonna put them in that tank. We're gonna drip back them into that. That way we can get them out of this small little tank and we can put them in some really nice <laughs> Cracky, we'll be back. Y'all, we're back from the fish store. We got our cage. This is where he's gonna be. So we're gonna add him to this bucket. To this bucket. I call this thing a bucket. The bucket. The bucket. We're gonna add him to this bucket. He's going with the eel because we know this water is perfect. The eel cannot get him in here. So everyone relax. We're gonna make sure that yolk sack, he's eating all that stuff and he lives. He's already, he's actually already swimming. He's swimming behind the rocks and stuff, swimming around. All right. Voila. Now we have a perfect view of the shark. We can go from the top and the side. You guys can see him perfectly. And we're gonna give you guys great updates and a great view of this guy. All right, now guys, we're gonna drip back and him to this water so he's able to survive, and then we're gonna watch this thing grow. It is time to add our shark to his temporary cage here. Let's scoop him out and see how he looks in there. Way cooler than the other shark we had. Get in there, brother. I don't wanna mess up Get his in there, buddy. Oh yeah, look at him swimming right in the net. Hell yeah. Let me whap this. Bang, he ain't going anywhere. He's there stuck he in that cage. Now get a really good look at his face there. Look how cool his face looks. That thing is sick. That's one cool looking alligator to me. Whoa! Yeah. That's a crocky. That thing is awesome. We're gonna got a good view of it and we're gonna watch it as it grows every day by the second. It's gonna be sick to keep you guys updates on this thing. And once he's giant, I cannot wait to feed him some crazy, crazy stuff. All right, y'all, that's it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed this whole dark web, black market kind of series. Comment down below another cool place to order some fish from. It can be like the dark web, it can be like the black market, somewhere along those lines. Leave it down below, and also leave some skit ideas down below. I'm sure you guys are clever and can come up with some awesome skits. But that's it for today's video. Stay buzzing, we're out. Bye.